please begin. Thank you, Nayan, sir. Filled with, with the blessing of Swayam Bhunath and Pasupatinath, I would like to extend my warmest greetings to everyone present in this wonderful session. My great attitude goes to IIU for giving me a platform to speak about my wonderful Kathmandu city. Today, I, Sarah Shusha, a student of a Hibiscus English Morning School, Nepal, I am talking about my birthplace, my city, Kathmandu. According to the mythologies, the Kathmandu Valley was once a huge lake surrounded by hills. Manjushri of China saw a big lotus at the center of the lake. To retrieve it, he cut away a hill and the water was drained away. The famous Soyamunath temple is now where the lotus was at. Kathmandu, the capital of Nepal, is known by many names. City of Glory, City of Temple, Gateway to Nepalese Himalaya. Now I'm going to tell why. Geographical features, it lies in the central part of the Nepal. It has ranges from 1200 to 2100 meter from sea level. Its altitude 1200 to 2100 meter from sea level. Its temperature and climate is mild from five degrees Celsius to 25 degrees Celsius. If you ever think of visiting Kathmandu, September to November is the best time. Historical important. Kathmandu is rich in history and has been major city for Nepal in, since ancient time. It has been ruled by many dynasties like Kurat dynasty, Malla dynasty, Gopal dynasty, and etc. Some monuments are as old as 1500 years old can be found. Some important historical sites are Kathmandu Darbar Square and Dharara. Kathmandu Darbar Square. It was once the royal palace for, of Malla and Saha. The main compound was built in 15th century. Dharara. It was first built by Bhimsen Thapa in 1832. It was destroyed twice by earthquake, once in 1934 and in again in 2015 by earthquakes. It this shows the not giving up attitude of a Nepali who always get back up. It is a home to some house around it, thousand temples, big and small. So it is also called a city of a temple. Some important religious are Pasupati Nath Temple and Soimbu Nath Temple. Pasupati Nath Temple. It is one of the most important temple for Hindu temple for Hindu around the world. It is built at the Holy Bhagmati River. The temple dates back to fourth century. It is included as a world heritage site. Soimbunath Temple. It is a very important temple for both Hindus and Buddhists. It is believed to be built in fifth century. Since the hill was since the hill's temple is home to many monkeys and it is called also called a monkey temple. Frankly, I hours about my beautiful city and I could still not be enough. Names like City of Glory, City of Temple. So how great it truly is. I hope my presentation helped you all to see the magnificence of this city. With this, I could to end my presentation and I am looking forward to learn about all your cities as well. Thank you and namaste. mountain including Mount Everest. Hello and namaste everyone. I am Miss Fungima Lindu. I started in grade 7 at Miss English Boys School, Ran Nepal. The first mountain including Mount Everest. Hello and namaste everyone. I am Miss Fungima Lindu. I started in grade 7 at Miss English Boys School, Ran Nepal. Sorry, Nayan, can you mute yourself, please? Thank you. You may continue. I'm representing, I'm representing the fertile flatland of Nepal. 
with my city, Haran, in the topic, my region, my city. I was born in a small city, which is located on the foothills of the Mahabharata range in the, in the north and its southern tip touching the edges of the Rai Dharan. It is the largest sub-metropolitan city of province number one by area. The Koshi highways run through the heart of a city. Thus, the connecting with cap provincial capital with Biratnagar as well as Ithari Junction of East to West Mahindra Highway. The climate here is mild, generally warm and temperate. In winter season, there is less rainfall than in summer. However, spring and autumn are the best season to visit Bharan. Khare Khola, very popular. Kali Khola, very beautiful. Sardu and Seoti Khola, seasonal rivers. These are the rivers inside and near my city. However, it has multiple multiple parks like Gorkha Park, BP or Oso Park, Hari Ali, Yalambar, Takela and Saptarangi Park. Major caste who live in my city are Limbu, Rai, Magar Guru, Brahmin, Thakuri with religious group, mainly Hindu, Kirat, Buddhist and Christian. My city is also famous for its signature dish, Alu Nimki. Streets of the Dharan are often lined up with vendors selling this delicacy and the blend of flavor that comes with its execution. Many tourists visit Dharan for its sightseeing places like Namaste Fall, Bhere Tar, Namche Bazaar, for hiking and adventurous places like river rafting and paragliding. One of the main attractions for tourists is Burasuba Temple, which is located at the top of Bijaypur Hill. Bijaypur Hill with highly scenic beauty. This temple is important and important and unique religious site to the Nepali people. This temple holds the communes cultural significance to the people of Dharan. Tourists visit for other temples like Vindeswari Temple and Dantakali Temple. Dharan represents the fertile lowland of Nepal. Unlike the northern Himalayas, being close to India to the south, it is mostly warm here. It needs plenty of ways to cool down. Dharan, as a city, is an ideal destination. Ideal destination for religious pilgrims adventure seekers and nature lover as well as even governments. So I as a representative representative of Dharan, anyone who would like to visit, welcome with our with our open arms. Thank you. Namaste everyone. I am Siddhartha Swetha, studying in grade 6 at Hibiscus English Boarding School. I am here to present a short presentation on the topic, My Reason, My Nation. Nepal is the country of the highest peak in the world, Mount Everest, and the birthplace of Gautam Buddha, Lumini. It is a diversity which are the physical features of Nepal. There are three tropical regions which are Himalayan, Hilly, and Thorai region. 
Nepal is surrounded by China in the north and India in, in the south, which is the land of natural beauty. The Nepalese Himalayas contain the eight of the world's ten highest peak in the world, including the highest point in the world, Mount Everest. Sulukumbu, the home of Mount Everest and its famous streets, lies in the eastern part of Nepal. The 14th district of Homes Number no. One also lies in the eastern part of Nepal. In the world of mountain tourism, Sulukumbu is a well known name. It is popular for its mesmerizing, breathtaking, and taking view for the mount, mountain covered with snow, mountain covered with snow, Buddhist temple, unique Sherpa culture, and museum that are named after it. Everest Base Camp. Everest Base Camp gives the best experience to the trekkers, to the trekkers and Sulukum. Sagarmatha National Park, which is amazingly rich in biodiversity. We can also explore several places like Khumbu Glacier, Island Peak Trekking, Mount Makalu, Mount Manaslu, and are the areas which are known for which are which are known for its uh, adventurous vacation. Sulukumbu district is known for its Sherpa community and Tengboche Monastery. Sherpa culture is well known in Khamjum village. Visiting Sulukumbu makes one feel as they are, they are near to heaven. So I encourage everyone to visit Sulukumbu. Thank you. Hmm.